Don't panic when you encounter a blue screen error. I'm going to show you how to fix this problem step by step. Let's begin. Click on advanced options. Then we need to select troubleshoot. Then select advanced options and then click on command prompt. Now execute this command carefully. Type chkdsk slash f slash r c colon and hit enter to execute this command. Type c colon and hit enter to execute the command. Then type cd space c colon slash and hit enter. Now type cd space windows and hit enter to execute the command. Now type cd system32 and hit enter. Now type cd space config and simply press enter to execute this command. Then type md space backup and hit enter. Now execute this command type copy space star dot star space backup and simply hit enter now execute this command type md space backup one then hit enter once we are here we need to execute this command type copy space star dot star space backup one and then press enter from your keyboard to execute this command now type cd reg back and hit enter now type dir and hit enter now type copy space star dot star space dot dot and hit enter then type all and hit enter to execute the command now type bootrec space slash fix mbr and hit enter to execute the command type bootrec space slash fix boot and hit enter now type cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter now type cd space windows slash system32 slash config slash regback and hit enter to execute now type this command bcd edit space slash export space c colon slash bcd backup and hit enter now type cd space c colon slash and hit enter now type md space boot and hit enter type cd space boot and hit enter now type md space bcd and hit enter now type cd space c colon slash and simply hit enter now type attrib space c colon dash boot dash bcd space dash h space dash r space dash s and hit enter to execute type in ren c colon backslash boot backslash bcd bcd dot old and simply hit enter to execute this command now execute this command type bootrec space slash rebuild bcd and simply hit enter to execute this command type exit and hit enter now click on continue it will restart your system so that's it guys your problem is solved and you are good to go